these are the supplies you're going to need to do the painting today. You're going to need black and white paint. We're going to make three colors out of that. You'll need paint containers and an assortment of brushes. I like to use ramekins covered in tin foil. Easy cleanup. I'm going to start with white in one container, black in another, and mix the two for gray in the third. I start by taping it off, eyeballing it, straight as lines as possible. I don't like to measure it. When I eyeball it, it gives a little bit more of a realistic look when I'm done in case any boards are slightly different in size. I start with white as a base. I do black by the tape and then I go in with the gray and scratch it up with the brush. I like to use a dry brush to scratch it. if. If that doesn't work, I dip it very lightly in black or white paint and blend it in. This is where you really get to be an artist and do every board a little bit different. This one I was not really liking so I kind of went in and edited a little bit and feel a lot better about the edits I did. The beauty of acrylic paint, you just keep going until it feels right. And water is a great way to blend it when it's just not working. Once the paint has dried a sufficient amount of time, I peel the tape off and move on to the next section. And I try to reuse my tape. Also use black, brown, and white to get more of a traditional wood look instead of the grayscale version I did here today. Here you'll see I use a ball of tin foil, and that gave the canvas a very scratched, realistic wood look. I really like that technique. When taping, it's important to leave a little bit of the last wood panel showing just ever so slightly. Doing that ensures no slivers of white canvas are left shown in between boards when you're done. When I got to this part, I wasn't too happy about having two light boards right next to each other, so I went in freehand, freestyle, and I made some edits that you'll see here. Once I did these edits, I felt like my painting was much better and just about complete. Now my background is complete, and ta-da, there it is. <laughs> 